Hello Alec. Hello Alec. I've been following your YouTube channel for a while and never thought I will be sending in a hand for review but I just had to send this one. I was playing a 9 handed. It is 5 10 dollars game. I had 9 10 of spades on the button. The action was folded to me and I raised $30. Both small blind and big blind called. They were both new players so I don't have a lot of history with them. But I did perceive both of them as general tight players. To the flop. Flop comes 6, 8, 9 with 6 and 8 of spades. Small blind bets 70 and big blind raises it to 220 before it comes to me. Now, at this point I am thinking that I have all three options open to me. I could fold, call or raise. However, based on thief betting pattern I felt that big blind probably is a very strong mate hand. I put him on a set or made straight. Two pair was a possibility but the bottom of his range. Also, I had one more person to act behind me who I was not sure what he had. So, if I called, I felt that the small blind may go all in, big blind would also shove. And I would be up against two strong hands in an all in situation. Also, I didn't want to gamble on 50-50 kind of draws. I also thought that irrespective of what happens on the turn, the big blind will surely go all in. And even if I hit a hand, I would not know whether it's good or not. I also thought that big blind wasn't deep enough to give me good implied odds for a draw. Not sure if that was correct calculation. Hello Alec. Eventually, I thought that I only have $30 invested in the hand and I should wait for a better spot. So I folded. Small blind also folded and that was it. What would you have done? I think I made a mistake. The hand kept coming up again and again in my dreams when I went home. Hope you review this hand. Cheers, zombie.